The number one restaurant in Deland may surprise you. Who knows? Maybe it'll offend you. This little town north of Orlando has numerous restaurants, many of which are right in Deland's wonderful little downtown district. I've been a regular diner here in Deland for many years, and I've got a degree at the Culinary Institute of America, but I know that does not make me an expert in any way. I believe that I'm an expert in this area because the time I've spent inside so many of these little restaurants. This is not a complete list of the good restaurants in Deland. There are other good restaurants that I didn't include here to keep what I believe are the absolute best. When I have prospective home buyers in town, they're often asking me what restaurants they should check out, and these are the ones where I'm typically sending them. Now, these aren't listed in any particular order, but number seven is the one that I think most of the longtime locals around here will agree on. This list of top restaurants is subjective, so please, as we go through this list together, put your comments in the comments section below about what restaurants you think should be on this list. I've had some really bad experiences too, but I won't be including those experiences as I'd prefer to spend this time focusing on what Deland restaurants are doing well. The first one is perhaps my personal go-to, and that's the Half Wall in Indiana Avenue. The Half Wall does have sister locations over in New Smyrna and Port Orange, but the Half Wall really just feels like Deland. Their burgers are the best, although it seems like someone in my party is always getting their fish and chips. They've got a ton of craft beers here too. When we're checking out one of the downtown festivals, we love sitting outside there like so many others do, many of which are sitting there with their pets. I'll probably get some flack for the next one as they've got one thing that drives me crazy about this little place, but the food at Anthony's on Orange Camp in Woodland cannot be beaten. Now, I'm sure some will say that it isn't the best pizza in town, even in Deland, but to me there's only one pizza with the same style that even really compares. Their salads and pastas are also fantastic. Oh, and, and the garlic knots. Locals, who do you think has the best pizza in Deland? Is it Angelina's? Is it Tony's? Tom's? What is it? My family knows that I love pizza, and as such, I feel that Fornabella Italian Restaurant in downtown Deland cannot be left off of this list. Fornabello makes a fantastic wood fire pizza, which is very different from the New York style pizza that Anthony's makes. Personally, the margarita and the Brussels sprouts pizza are the best. They too have several good salads and pastas, and I really like the atmosphere in this little place. Before I get to the controversial one of these top seven restaurants, if you're looking for more information like this, Hit the like and subscribe buttons and click that little notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I post other videos just like this. The next one is Emmy's Time Out Tavern, which specializes in German cuisine. Now, those of you that know me will likely call me a great big hypocrite for this one because Emmy's truly isn't a favorite of mine. However, I don't know that I've ever met anyone here in Deland that doesn't love this little place out on the edge of town on Old New York. I do like the Jägerschnitzel in here, but in my mind, most people know them for their steaks. The atmosphere is circa 1960s, but it's a staple for many of the locals. I hear that the owners are getting ready to sell this little place, so hopefully the new owners will continue what the former owners have done right for like 45 years now. The perfect spot up near the Deland Airport is a personal favorite of mine, but the food has little to do with it. Yes, the food and service are fine, but I'm usually heading up here for the atmosphere. In the winter months when it's cooler, I'm often sitting outside so that I can watch these parachuters just rain down from the sky. They've got a full bar if you want to drink, but there's nothing like this place for lunch when it's sunny and 75 outside. I spoke about this little place in another video of mine, so I'll leave a link to that at the end of this video. It's not that I'm crazy about Asian cuisine, but aside from my time in New York City, I believe Udum Thai and Sushi right downtown Deland is my all-time favorite. Their sushi and their pineapple fried rice is fantastic. Now, I know, I didn't really get that at first either, but once I broke down and tried the pineapple fried rice, I became an instant fan. There's usually a wait here, so if you want to get in and get out, you better get there right when their doors open. It's worth repeating here that there are other restaurants here in Deland that I absolutely love, but I have to simplify here, so please, don't be offended if I've left your restaurant off this list. If your favorite isn't listed here, make a note below and be sure to tell us why, why it's your favorite. Okay, the number one best restaurant in Deland is Santorini Greek Cuisine Downtown. They moved down the street just a bit a while back, and I think the location is better, but it's still a small little place. Like Udum that I spoke of before, give yourself plenty of time to wait for a seat. Their calamari appetizer is something we always get here. We love the moussaka and the lamb shank, which is usually enough for two meals, and the boss is Santorini the most. Santorini is a place where we've been many times and the service and food has never once let us down and I'm betting that you'll like it too. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.